My name is Matt Cunningham with the LG MVP Support Center. Today we're going to be talking about the LVN360 HV4. To set up, lay the downflow conversion kit parts out on a work surface. And lay your legs out, the tabs on the outside, and get your back plate, the flat piece, face down. Align your holes and attach your screws. Now we're going to grab our arms. Make sure the notch is on the outside. Put it on top of the leg. Align your holes and attach your screws. Again, make sure this notch is on the outside because if it's not, you don't have the bracket assembly correct. And now for your front plate. It goes inside your arms and make sure your lip is not up because you're going to want that flat because that's where your coil is going to slide on. Line your holes and attach your screws. Now that we have that, we're going to take our panels off and our brackets off. Now that we've removed our panels, our brackets, and our retaining wires, we're going to remove our sensors. Liquid sensors on your smaller line, you just pull it out, return our sensors down here. Your suction sensors on the left hand side. It is from the back side, so pull from the back side. Get your wires out of the way. You're now ready to remove your coil. This drain pan on the left hand side is used for the horizontal unit. We're not going to use that, so we're just going to remove it. Now that we have our cabinet flipped, we're going to insert our bracket. You just grab it, your legs facing the unit, push it into the back, make sure your legs go inside, push it down flush. And you attach your screws to your cabinet. So you just grab your wires and feed them up through your wire chase. Put them all the way through and then get them out of the way so you can insert your coil. So now you just grab your coil and slide it in. Make sure you don't crush your wires. You may have to take up on the back side to make sure it's all the way back. Now that we have our coil installed, we're going to install our return air sensor bracket. It has two holes and two holes on top of the unit. Just line up your holes and attach your screws. So now to install the return air sensor, see all black wire, grab it and pull it into the closest side of the cabinet, up through one hole, down through the other, and then make sure you pull your wires back down by your fan. Now that we've installed our return air sensor, we're going to go ahead and put our pipe sensors back on, put our panels and brackets back on. Now that we've reinstalled our wire retainers, our brackets and our panels, you've successfully completed the conversion kit of the LVN360 HV4 into a downflow air hammer. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit us at lghvac.com.